These are one of the coolest birds in Thailand. Five hours from here to Saratani Airport. So it's a long trip, but before that, before we catch the bus, I'm gonna give you some tips. It's so important if you are coming to Koh Samui. It's kind of the summary of our vacation and exploration two days here in this island. First thing about this Hotel Ibis, it's so beautiful, so nice, the pool, the beach, the amenities, the service, the price is so affordable, the breakfast. The only downside is that the rooms are too small. We've booked pool access, but minimum space, it's too small. That's the only downside of this hotel. You can eat rice? Eat. Transportation. Transportation is a big issue in Samui Island. So I'm gonna give you the basic tips so that you will know which transportations to use and how to save money while you are in Samui Island. The first tip, take the bus from Samui Piers to the main shores of Koh Samui. And if you are at the hotel, as you are going to see now, you can take also the bus to the pier. So that's the cheapest way. Now, how to find bus? This is the paper. This paper is available in every hotel in Samui. So you can take the paper, check the hours, which time the bus leaves and how much it is, and you are going to save a lot of money. Where to stay in Samui? That's a big question. We've explored Poput and Chawang. Poput is very calm, beautiful. The shore, the beach, the atmosphere, it's really nice. And Chawang is kind of Patong. If you have ever been in Phuket, in Patong area, Chawang is copy paste. If you love the hustle and bustle, crowded shores, then Chawang should be your choice. But if you love such places, calm, beautiful, then you can stay in Poput. It's up to you. We've been here for two days and the weather was amazing, but now it's so windy. Let's go and catch the bus. Hopefully it will be here on time. And of course, along the way to share with you everything you need to know if you are leaving Samui Island now to Bangkok. Let's go. So the bus is here after 15 minutes, just on time. Shuttle bus, taxis, tour informations, everything is available at the information desk at this hotel and in every hotel in Koh Samui. So no worries, let's take the bus and go to the pier. it's around 1 p.m. so I guess we are going to take the ferry at 1 let's go to Suratani
Let's sit inside because it's too hot outside and the seats are more comfortable here at least you can sleep relax a little bit till we reach Suratani. That's another story I'll tell you later. Welcome back to Suratani Airport. First, let's check our flight. I think now we are flying Vietjet Airways. Yeah. Vietjet Airways 1940. <laughs> Usually, domestic flights are always delayed. We are flying Vietjet Airways going to Suvarnabhumi Airport, and our flight is 30 minutes delayed. No problem. At least we are here, as you see, almost one day from Koh Samui <laughs> to Bangkok. I'm so hungry. Let's find something to eat. I got how? And this? Chicken. Chili chicken? Mexican, Mexican chicken. Fried rice chicken. Bon appetit. Not bad, it's only 500 Thai baht, everything we have ordered. So today we are flying with Vietjet Airways, that means that we are landing at Suvarnabhumi Airport. When we came, we came with Nok Airways that flies from Dongmong Airport. Vietjet Airways is a good airline, but as I said, domestic airlines always delay. We still got around two and a half hour, let's wait the check-in time. Wherever you travel guys in Thailand, you are always going to miss Bangkok. Even it's busy, traffic, hustle and bustle, Bangkok is different. Koh Samui, Koh Kut, Pattaya, Phuket, but we are always going back to Bangkok. Let's go. This is the first time they are checking our bags because if you have more than 7 kilograms, I think you have to pay. Now, uh, domestic departures, let's go. I hate this part. This is the worst part at the airport. You have to remove your items, your laptops. I hope one day they will find a solution for this. I love traveling, flying, but I hate this part at the airport. Welcome to Bangkok. This is the best thing you can hear in your life.
no immigration, no headache. Just go out and take the transportation that you like. We are going to take the airport link, fastest way, cheapest way. So let's go to the base floor. Thank you. Airport link base floor. This is Payataya station and from here we are going to exchange it with the BTS line, the SkyTrain and go back to Prakanum where we have started our journey. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog and had an idea about Koh Samui and moreover how to travel from Koh Samui to Bangkok. Thank you for watching. See you in another vlog.